I got my start in sports journalism actually when my athletic career mostly came to an end. Uh, it was my junior year in high school and I was planning to go to college on a soccer scholarship and I tore the meniscus in my right knee, which now is a pretty common injury. It's a cartilage pad between a couple of bones in your leg. But when I did it back in the day, it was still not as common as it is now. So the doctors did the surgery and I expected to play again, but I knew that as soon as I finished my rehab that I was never really gonna be the same player again. So I, uh, I got extremely lucky and I had a couple of school advisors say, hey, you love to talk, you're always doing the school announcements and leading cheers at football games, and you love sports. So why don't you try to make sports journalism, and sports broadcasting a career? We know you love to write as well. So my senior year, I signed up for the school newspaper and they asked what we wanted to do and I said I wanted to write for the sports section. And my senior year in high school, I fell in love with sports journalism. So my first ever foray into sports broadcasting or journalism, I was a print journalist. And I used to just cover all the sports and the teams that I used to play for. And it was a wonderful way for me as a former athlete to stay in touch with all the sports that I knew and loved and also stay in touch with all the people I missed because I missed my teammates like crazy. Um, so my senior year in high school writing for the school newspaper, that's how I got into sports broadcasting.